and oh no not sleep no i just have to cut well that was already 40 minutes again of this chapter i think i don't know how many i have of chapter four uh, chapter six just just way too much okay Probably. I'll try something. Just hang on to that.
Almost. Maybe I can cheese it that way. I think I can make it. it into the chip. I need to get... Let me. Why am I thinking about What did I think about that? Just let it push me into it. I don't care if it squishes me when the level ends. <laughs> that was. with the box thinking. Oh god, there are sparkles. Always oh, great to see your sparkles. That was sarcasm, by the way. Yes, I picked up on that. Aren't you perceptive? You said that you'll let me go once I become the ultimate hero. So how do I do that? When will it be enough? You're not ultimate as long as there is room for improvement. So as long as I can generate harder challenges for you to complete, you do not qualify as ultimate. Wait a minute. Is there a limit to how hard you can make these challenges? No, I can always generate harder challenges. 
So basically, I will either fail or die, or will I will keep doing this forever? Yes, that seems to be the case. That's insane. I did not set these param parameters. I am only doing what I was programmed to do. Programmers are the worst. I'm definitely sending an angry email once I get out of here. There has to be a way out of here. One, two, three, four. Can count five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven levels left. too high on the cube. Also don't know chaotic is part also part of the indie game collective so yes he also had access to the game so I don't have I haven't made this uh, command From there, you can find all the creators that are part of the collective from our ma uh, managed Twitter account. I take a break. Taking a break. Only play chapter one though. Yeah, I think out of all, I think I'm I'm one of the only ones or few 
to actually play more of it rather than the first look. And I'm dedicated now to finish this. see another way because I have to what I've been doing wrong. trying to do. to stand on that one. Ah, 
Think, Josie, think. Don't let some stupid, all-powerful supercomputer outsmart you. But how am I supposed to defeat it? The ability to bend reality seems a little OP. Yeah. Hmm. It's a little bit insane. The issue is I have nothing to jump back up on. I... try something.
Yeah, got it. Got it, got it. But now I need to make it, but I... Th it is possible to do it that way. Data cubes in level uh, chapter six. with the Stockholm Syndrome talking, but I'm starting to miss sparkles. What am I saying? Sparkles never existed. I'm just... just that stupid simulator toying with me. But it doesn't seem like it has much of a choice. It has a goal that it can't complete, so it's basically trapped in here, same as me. Giant head, are you there? I have a proposition. I'm listening, Sunblaze. I think I figured it out. You're going to have to fight me, and you can't hold back. Why would I do that? Contrary to what you may believe, it's not my desire to kill you. I know. You want me to succeed. Like you said, you've been generating challenges that you can know I can handle. But I can never succeed with training wheels on. To become the ultimate hero, I have to defeat the ultimate villain. What better villain is there than a supercomputer that can bend reality? Your logic is sound, but I'm not sure about this. It's the only option. The only way to achieve your goal. 
Are you sure you want to do this, Josie? I'm sure I don't want to be stuck in here forever. So you're going to have to try and kill me. No big deal, right? All right, I will. It says reluctantly. Goodbye, Sparkles. Goodbye, Josie. Oh, boss fight. Boss fight over one, two, three, four stages? Nani? I see it. I'll take it slower and This is the fight over. Oh my god. Well, uh, hope you like spiders. I guess this is the part where I kill you. Don't count on it.
Ah, uh, I get. Okay, I see. I see. I see. Ah. Ah. Stand here. I need to go to the right, I need to go to the right. <laughs> than I think. I'm not... I have to just run down. Cannot jump. Okay, 
skull phase. Oh god, we have to find a unicorn! Josie! Dad! I didn't... I don't know how, but you did it, kid. Look how ripped Dad is! <laughs> oh my god! How did you manage to get us out of there? I had to defeat a giant robot spider. But it was also a unicorn. You had to be there, it was a whole thing. Sounds like it. I'm a legit superhero now, Dad. It was terrifying, also kind of awesome. You'll have to tell me all about it. I'm so glad you made it out safely. You did try to warn me that a training simulator is not a toy. Yes, I did. Ah, oh, pet the kitty. Oh, you can hold the button down to uh, hold head. Oh. Maybe don't tell your mama all about this. I don't think she'd be very happy. You've got it, Dad. No, that looks cute. <laughs> the oh. We are the kitty! You unlock the lost levels. Oh no. Thank you for playing, you're awesome. Mrs. Pride saves the day! <laughs> Sunblaze credits, Sven Magnus, aka Mudloop, game design, and other Tom Philhall, Furkan Gulus, Fernando Borden, Bordon, Jose Bor Bor Borba, I don't know, El Sato, Pixelwise, Story consultants, many more studios need those. And bonus stage publishing, the publishing people. But yeah, that was Sunblaze. A really, really cool action platformer inspired by games like Super Meat Boy, Celeste. It was fun playing that. Very much, I have to say, the A. Hey, look at that. <laughs> there are some of ours I don't think I am in this list. Yeah. I think that is because initially I wasn't part of, uh, didn't uh, apply with the others, but hey, that is something not that bad. But hey, that was Celeste, a really tight platformer. Oh, I got the lost levels, do you? I think we'll do this at another time in a bonus stream. But yeah, that was Sunblaze. I enjoyed every little bit. Every level had some, uh, something with it. Mechanically, I mean, mechanically, I loved chapter four and five the most. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit... it's a little bit late. But yeah, I think, yeah, chapter 2 is missing some boxes. 
But yeah, chapter four or five, my favorites out of all. Platforming, super tight, challenging, but not unfair. And if it uh, seemed unfair to you, there is always the Zen mode, which is drastically easier than this. And if this wasn't challenging enough, well, you can try the hard mode after doing everything. So there is something for everyone. <laughs> but yeah, I think absolutely worth it. With the links provided in the description and chat, you can go and check out the game go grab it for yourself and have some fun but that being said i have to end it here hope you all enjoyed me going through uh, watching me going through all this and i can see you again the next time for more game adventures thanks for watching see you then